Now would be a good time to stock up on items. Good call. We've racked up a ton of gil now that you mention it. You have to wonder why a bunch of mirages are carrying so much cash. Let's just say that Emma Crow... Never mind, I figured it was her. Oh, hey viewers, guess what? Um... In this part... Uh, Tom, Tom, is, Tom is technically dead. Um... Now what that means... Because, technically I'm trying to do the Nuzlocke thing. Uh, we get to replace her with Mandgore, which I guess is, uh... Pretty alright. Uh, I feel bad. I would say Lon is technically taken out, but unfortunately, much like in Pokemon, uh, you can't remove the player character, and... So, why don't we go back to Cornelia and see Princess Sarah? Oh, thanks. There's my next objective, while I try to hold a sad part of being like, Tama, why? She's gone. All I was gonna say is, um, now, now she's just in the prism case, uh... Pretty much forever throughout this whole entire thing. Uh, she's pivotal to the plot, so it doesn't necessarily mean she's gone. It just means she's like no longer gonna be on my team. Also, I totally want this. Totally want this. Here. Cause you see, mover increases the SP of all your party members. It's it's a really nice thing to get. Um probably should have done this beforehand but basically yeah all uh all of everyone's sp is like up one which is great because actually now that i mention it uh, i can get the photosynthesis which is totally something i want because it it casts regain regain whatever it don't matter and point is um i got i got sweet ability i got sweet passive that lon will uh, possibly have at the start of every battle also, I wanted to check the Chocolate Mart, because, uh... Oh, hey. I wasn't ready for this yet! What is this place? Uh. Lon! Are you alright? Uh, yeah. Did you just see that? Should you two be here? A Tonberry? Quite so. A Tonberry through and through. Now should you children be this far afield? Far up what now? He's asking if we're lost. I guess he's got a point. I have no idea where we are. As I thought. Then you should both come with me at once. It's not safe here. give you the Colosseum. Oh man. Okay, we got the Colosseum. The Colosseum is a special place that you can, uh, by adversaries, this, the thing is telling me. But point is, um, you can you can like complete chapters, uh, unlock chapters, and collect mirages. Any mirages. There you go. Read that at your own discretion. It doesn't matter. Um, close. I don't care about it. Pause the video if you do. Point is, uh, you can collect mirages here, and that's pretty dope. Cause uh, there is a particular mirage that I would like to collect, that I have access to doing this, but uh, I'm not level 14 and I totally need to be level 14 if I was gonna go attempt that. Also our little Mandagore friend over there, he's... He, she, it... I should probably go with it. Gender neutral term, in other words. Um, it's, it's not very high level. Um, sure I am, Lon is and Rain is but uh i want i want to be level 14 so i'm i'm gonna go to the next area for attempting this point is i'm gonna say i get one free mirage of my choosing here and i already have it uh 
I already have it, I already have it in mind, and it's going to be something excellent. And I already know who I'm going to name it after, so uh, we'll 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 resume that in a second. I wasn't ready for this. The game just threw something at me and it threw me a curveball, and I'm just like, oh, what are you doing to me, game? I'm not ready for all this. All I wanted to do was go to the marketplace and, and get the thing. But I have access to the Coliseum now, which is pretty all right, if you ask me. I'll be I'll be tackling that on soon enough. All I was gonna do is like go here and see what you have for me, chocolate. Uh, I can't get that, but I could totally get these, and that's pretty all right if you ask me. Um, I don't need anything. You don't really have anything I'm looking for right now. Also, you want to go back to the Coliseum? Tom Barry is right there. You talk to him. He's like, "Oh, go to Coliseum," and you're like, "Yeah," and he'll take you there. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. I guess I'm just trying to get through this quick and fast in a hurry. And uh, I've already wasted enough time. Ah, oh, we're already, like, what, six minutes in? And you guys are like, uh, Gildam, can we just get on with the game? Yes. Yes, we can. Go to Cornelia. Well, it'll all be good. I should probably turn in that side quest. Which, oh. Chapter 5. The champion who saved Grimoire. From the looks of the it, the Bahamushan encampment is going to stay a goblin to hang out for good. At least they'll leave Cornelia alone for a while, now that we've gotten rid of the soldier controlling them. Once mirages are scattered and separated from their keeper, they revert to their wild state. And wild mirages are something you just learn to get used to in Grimoire. That's why you've got Mr. Warrior here. Yes, indeed. However, we cannot rule out the possibility of another Bahamut attack. What we need is an alliance with another country. Some sort of mutual agreement to come to each other's defense. Actually, word has been spreading of such an organization. An anti-federation group as large as a nation. Perhaps the time has come to formally introduce ourselves. They call themselves the League of S. League of S? Do you know of any way to reach them? The Thane of Seronia to the north has been in contact with them. I believe one of the merchants mentioned it. Seronia, yes. They have been resisting Federation annexation. Yes. Highness, allow me to journey there and learn what I can about the League of S. Alone? To get to Seronia, you must pass through all manner of places teeming with dangerous mirages. And I... Hey, maybe we could go instead. Yeah. Mr. Warrior here, he and the Brigade should stick around and keep the goblins in line. That's right. Cornelia's legendary champion belongs right here in Cornelia. We're the best fit for this. We've got tons of mirages to collect, and could start just about anywhere. So, you know, it wouldn't be any trouble. What a kind offer. You would really do that? Sure. You're doing us a favor by pointing me and Lon in a new direction. We're glad to help. I thank you. We are in your debt. Here, all Cornelian emissaries are given these letters as proof of their authority. It should help you on your way. Thanks. Well, there's no sense in hanging around. Hmm. So long. Take care. Bye-bye, bye-bye! Uh, your Highness. Oh, man. Now we're emissaries. Now we have to... dwell into the politics of this place. Okay. Then let's get going to the Seronia place. Just hop on the train and take that choo-choo the north. I'm not doing that now. You know what I'm doing? I, I gotta I gotta turn in the quest thing that I got. You see that star? That star means accomplishment. Oh, you really brought me an earth hammer. I can't tell you how much I appreciate this. Now I can ensure my helmet is always in tip top condition. I can't stand unsightly dents. I know it isn't much, but please accept this as a token of my thanks. Five high potions. There we go. Mini venture. I'm gonna call them side quests because that's pretty much what they are. Uh, but yeah, I turned that in. I got five high potions. Uh, the Earth Hammer. 
is also a usable item. It does medium earth damage. Which is kind of cool, I guess. Right. Tickets, please. Oh man, okay. Uh, well... I guess we're headed towards the north! Go on then, all aboard! Let's do it! Let's go on an adventure! Holy amaze! I could stare for days! At this place... Looks like we're gonna have to find a way through. <laughs> oh man! We got... We have a use for the sizzle ability! And you wanna know something funny? I have the sizzle ability. Uh, that uh, Freet thing that we got. You know, the baby Ifrit that we got for uh, fighting Ifrit. Um, totally, totally has that ability, and you know what? I taught my guy that ability, so we have it. Um, oh man, there's so much I want to get into, but, uh, I don't know. Uh, you know what? I think we should return to Nine Wood Hills. I think there's something very important. What? My senses are the telling me some kind of door has appeared in Nine Wood Hills. Hey! I think I was right! this thing it sure looks like a door but does it even go anywhere hello let's check it out B hey uh what where are we now Visitors? What an unusual surprise. Um, who are you? And where are we? My name is... Huh? Who's right there on the tip of my tongue? Use it or lose it, I suppose. Oh, but this is my tea room. So who are you? Will you join me for tea? Uh, well... You might say that we're sort of passing through, but I'm Lon, and this is... It's Rain, and my brother and I are from Ninewood Hills. Lon and Rain from Ninewood Hills. <gasps> of course! I had a dream about this. I saw the two of you come here. Today's the day. Huh? Right. I think I might know why you've come here. Shall we get started? Uh... Sorry, come again? You know what me and Rain are doing here, even though we don't have the slightest clue? Mm-hmm. Your keepers looking for new mirages. You've come to touch the souls of your friends, their past, present, and future, to step into their shoes and fight when mirages threaten them and they need you most, to sway them towards success. Correct? Uh, I don't know. Wow, dude. That was a lot of words. Hey, Rain, you follow that? Uh-uh. Nope. I'm officially lost. So, whose soul will you touch? Oh, man. More sad quests. Well, I guess they're called intervention quests, but uh, the these are special quests, and they're they're really cool in a lot of ways. Um, yeah, you can, you can read that and... Get the idea, I think. Um, oh, you can also buy champion medals, which are super dope. And uh, I think we're, I think we're gonna have to do that. I think we are going to have to do that, like right now. But I'm totally saving, so you know, give me a second. All right. Uh, all this said. We might be doing one of these intervention quests. I feel like that is a great way to wrap up this entire part. Also, I think we only have one at the moment. Good evening. What now? So basically, we can trade in our Arma Gems. I told you we'd be using those. Hey, what are these Arma Gem things? Hmm? 
You found some armor gems? We're not exactly sure what they're for, but we did turn up a few. That's good. They have great value here. You can think of those gems as a kind of token. Token? Yes. In order to touch another's soul, or to tamper with time, first, you must offer compensation, hence the armor gems, tokens you can pay in recompense. Oh, so the more we find, the more stuff we can do here. Hmm, right. But isn't that kind of dodging the question? Okay, they're tokens, but where do they come from? You needn't wonder about every little thing. Huh? The world has some secrets. You're simply better off not knowing. Okay. Oh man, I told you. Army champs, they're awesome. Okay, yeah, that stuff. Okay, special place, got it. Um, mainly boss fights. You get them from boss fights. Alright, you know what? Next time, we're gonna do some side quests and stuff like that. I think we... I think we've done quite a bit in this part. Uh, next time... We're gonna do even more stuff and it's gonna be awesome! Oh man. I just hope I don't kill any more mirages. That's gonna be super depressing. Alright, uh, talk to you guys later.